the vlog action. See, so right now, Hobby lobbying it up. Then he got some coffee and ran around a little bit. Right? Trying Shit. to see what's popping with the movie after. Moving, probably hit the mall a little, little bit. Shit, ain't got too much. We're going to see. People be asking me, when you going to vlog again? When you going to vlog again? I'm like, I ain't doing nothing. But, why, but why are we standing in the pumpkin aisle? Though? Like, what are we doing? I some pumpkins. <laughs> so. Some pumpkin spice latte. Shit, well, see what this Hobby Lobby is. About to skate up from here. Go hit the mall. See all the shit that I'm not gonna buy. Just walking in, looking nice, looking. Not like nothing. But they ain't really got no stores worth a damn right here anyway. Towel bets. Arab hostel. They ain't got shit. Get by the sneaker stores and stuff. In a few. This shum, this shum right there. They got them. Them right there. Ugh. These things ten and a half. Shay. Other than that, six rings and stuff like that. I ain't messing with no six rings. I'm good. Tings over there, boy. What them what them tings is slow? Valenciaga. Designer. Oh. Them off black. <laughs> what the hell that shit is? Hmm? Well. Puma. No hove in no uh, nipping and mess with Puma, man, but I can't I can't do it. I can't do it. Even even J. Cole, even J. Cole, man, I, I can't can't mess with the Pumas. Sorry. Some some Yeezys? <laughs> no, that's young Jesus, not Yeezys. <laughs> you know, I did eyes. That's all you seeing, she foot locker. Foot locker don't be having too much no more. Puma, the rebooks, rebook. Wedding bitches for the twenty nine. Give my sons a wedding bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Slim pickings, Slim pickings. And now for the classics, classics on them. Bronze, some bronze, about it. The Air Max. Flights, six rings. Ugh. Got a little sale on the Hoochie Daddies, 25% off. I like them hoes right there. But they like 60, they too much. They too much that I want to spend. But that's my shit. I love me some hoochie daddies, nah. Pause. Like it's right there. Oh, they got, they got these still in the store. Lowe's. Deltas. Fugazis. And of course, Six Rings. Iverson, I don't, I don't like them though. Not crazy about them. This something. Classics. I'm still Reebok classing, classicking it up in the booth. <laughs> Champs clothes don't be bad sometimes, man. She $14 for the hoodie. She $14 on the pants. But I'm pretty good, man. I got all these colors and like tech fleece and shit. If not, I sure would cop me a pair. F finally got some J's in this bitch. Put them teams right there. This is City Gear. City Gear. Let's see what's behind, what's behind me. Got them Griffiths. Got them Griffith joints. Oh. Them 
Griff is nice. I get he to he uh carrying on uh dumpster Duke the dumpster Joseph legacy. Got the superheroes in the building. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Got a little crowd up in here. What's up? What you know about Thor? What you know about Thor? Don't know nothing about Thor. Uh oh, oh, Winter Soldier and them. They not in the movie. They not in the movie. She still doing the vlog. Man, I was gonna do it just a, a review. I'ma just throw the review in the, in the middle of the vlog. So just finished watching Thor, man. This bitch right here, yo, Ragnarok was perfection. If that was perfection, this right here was in, mm, yo, over the top. This was it was super silly. This was yeah. the, the silliest Marvel movie. This shit right here was yeah. like I don't know what to say. But like the last 20 minutes was was it had some epicness to it. But it started off, it started off, you think this bitch about to be serious, about to be tough. Yeah. The rest was silly. This was this was a Marvel movie. Uh, it was it was signed fail with a with a big budget. Yeah. <laughs> um Gore, the guy killer, like even he was silly. And like you think after the way it opened, I don't wanna spoil it, but the way it opened, you think he would have been like he, he had some pretty good scenes, like whenever it was him, but like everybody else, like Jane yeah. Foster or Tessa Thompson. Yeah. Uh, Thor's getting dumber by each movie. He getting dumber. Man, they, they showed Zeus and the other guys. They were super silly. Everybody on here was silly, silly, silly. This was like this was like this a SpongeBob episode. This was like, yeah, it was yeah. down that that vein. Guardians of the Galaxy. It was. They were super silly. silly. Oh, and in the last one, it was silly, but like I said, it had a heart and it had a seriousness to it. That point, this didn't feel like it had any stakes. Like it just was, it was no. over the top. And and then like I know everybody don't read all the comic books or something, but if you read anything and see anything about Gore the God Butcher, yeah, and you and you look forward to this character right here, yeah, this don't be dude, disappointed. this dude was in, in the comic books. He is so dark and, and gruesome and shit, yeah. powerful. This right here was it was a, a whimper. Yeah, yo, this was this was you see you see the biggest blackest. Strongest dude, and he trying to be Bob Sapp. <laughs> it's like, yeah, this motherfucker was supposed to be super powerful, and yeah, no, no, he Bob mm -hmm. Sapp. Yeah, I mean, and I, I ain't gonna shit that. It did have some heart in certain areas, like the Jane Foster stuff had some heart uh, with what she was going through. Um, but, like, it was so disjointed because you would have a serious moment, then something real silly. Yeah. Let me cut, cut you cut y'all real, real, real quick. Slow. Yo. What you what you thought about this one, man? What you thought about this one? <laughs> I think it, it came from too much of like a comedic aspect. I was looking for a little bit more horror, a little bit more darkness in it. Um I if I I would probably give it a C. Honestly, me. So yeah. what's your shit? What's what, what's, what's your rating? What you, what you give it? You giving it grades now? Or, yeah. you, you give it out of 10. I'm going to give mine out of 10. I'm still, uh, still I, prolificating. Uh, <laughs> I, I think this is probably a 6.5 for me right here. I mean, it's... That's, that's what I was thinking, too. Yeah. That's what I was thinking, it's, too. It's not, yeah. it's not bad, bad. I ain't going to give it under 5 in percentage-wise or something to say it's trash. Yeah. Like, it had entertaining aspects or something. This bitch was just so silly. Yeah, it was like some Teen Titans or some shit. Like, like it was, it was made for Tyler's. Yeah, if it wouldn't have been for the last thirty minutes, it would yeah. have been a five. Honestly, yeah. man, the the the, the yeah. end of the end of that bitch, the end of the bitch kind of tough. The end of the bitch kind of tough, but man, the, just the just, the overall aspects of the film. And then him him making kids worthy. And that <laughs> scene was. I lost my shit right there. And now. that was that was like to appease like uh the children. Children watching it and be like, oh, representation. Mm. <laughs> yes. Look at look at us. 
Ke- Kevin Feige gonna have to have a room meeting. He gonna have to start. If, if we want want to keep it serious, want to keep it real on the status of Marvel Cinema after Spider Man, yeah. she been going down here. Doctor Strange wasn't what we thought it was gonna be. Miss Marvel is Dookie, yeah. <laughs> and Thor is my second favorite Marvel character. Like from his films or something, I'm like, man, I love Thor films, and this right here. It's right here. It dropped the ball. It dropped the ball. The ball, dog. Yeah, yeah. And I don't know. I don't know where they go. I just think it's too much silliness. They need to take a step back from the silliness. Like get back to that Captain America Winter Soldier type aspect. But it's stuff. I think they just leaning towards that way. Like the old guard yeah. of of like grown people that been been reading the books. Like they came out in the '60s and stuff, and we was fans of it. Mm-hmm. Like they killed the Tony Starks. Captain America gone, like uh, a lot of old people are starting to leave the films or something. I think they just now like, we're gonna we're gonna get the kids. We got Miss Marvel and stuff. Mm-hmm. And yeah, so as soon we're gonna have the uh the little West Coast Avengers or the, the little the little teen Avengers and yeah. shit, and everybody gonna be gone. It's gonna be nothing but children. Hopefully by the time we get, I hope at least Miles Morales gone. Hopefully by the time we get X-Men, I hope they'll take it a little more serious. It's going to be nothing but children on the X-Men. I mean, which... They, they ain't going to bring back nobody big. Which wouldn't <laughs> be wrong, but I mean, it was just... The X-Men was always dark. Yeah, so, but, you, you can't really, really lighten that up too, yeah. too much. Well, anyways, so you're about to try to get a little something to eat or something, man. Get, get the hell on. Instead of in front of the cinema, we loitering. Uh, yeah, we we will see what we, if we find some grub or something. Everything closed so damn early. Peace. <laughs> so end up at Buffalo Wild Wings. It's lemonade and ain't no you know alcoholic drink. <laughs> That's a, some more bonus on on year on year. What is what is what is tasting like? Slow. It's cool, man. We went with the um. Smash bacon burger, you know. Lish yum, lish yum. Well, I passed this this night. She's getting up out the crib, getting out the country. So, let me get back to my food. Night is over. Shit, uh, night is over. Let me see. Yeah, Buffalo Wild Wings in the bag. Went to went to the Buffalo. They, they gave me a burger with no bacon, and then they gave me some cold <laughs> wings. But I didn't cut up because we was in a rush. So, yeah. Yeah, so, hey, y'all been asking for a vlog. So you got your vlog. She got your review inside this. Because store, it wasn't worthy of a, of a review on its own. So, it's going to be in the vlog. But, uh, yeah, good night. High you. Peace.